We are halfway through Last Gadget Standing. We've seen karaoke, we've seen mattresses, we've seen pet treats. God only knows what we're going to see for our last five. But to kick things off, oh, somebody took my sheet, hold on. I still, you're okay. All right, hold it, hold it. I honestly thought you were clapping because I was walking over and like filling time. But as I said, I don't need the love handles, I already have them. Okay, next up, to introduce the folks from Mechanoid. No, you're not introducing yourselves, calm down. From Laptop Magazine, someone who's presented here before, fantastic guy, big round of applause for Avram Pilch. Avram, come on up here. Go get him, Avram. So when we were judging this, uh, I told the guys here that if I could uh, give two of my votes to Mechanoid, I would do it. So, so what I'm gonna have to do here is just uh, give the same uh, presentation twice. Uh, but I really think that uh, this robot speaks for itself. How many of you have played with an erector set? What if your erector set was programmable and could talk back to you? Uh, Meccano uh, is known as a rector here in the US and uh, what they have here is a robot kit uh, that you can turn into uh, something that looks a lot like Wally -E or Johnny number no. five or a robotic dinosaur. It can do, follow you by motion capture. Your kids can program it. It'll take voice commands. It'll take app commands. Uh, it's really a ton of fun. Uh, so let's see. Uh, Chris Hardwin, Andres Gaza, and Felipe Garza uh, show us uh, Mechanoid. Hi everybody, we're from Spin Master Toys. As he was saying, Meccano, it's been inspiring engineers, inventors, great minds for over a century. You know it as a rector set. And we're taking it to the next ship for the next generation, doing something new and exciting. Let me introduce you to, or let me, let him introduce himself. I am the Mechanoid G15KS. I am an advanced robotics building platform. I was created to interact with human beings and learn from them. I mean, My purpose is to teach every man, woman, and child about how fun and simple robotics can be. I mean, this is a robotic toy I dream that we all dreamed of having as kids. A robot friend that you can actually build Imagine that, and it's a first of its kind. This is the life-size humanoid robot that's actually gonna be accessible. It's gonna sell for $3.99 at retail. It's also gonna be incredibly easy and intuitive to program. We wanted to make this for everybody, not just for computer programmers. Anybody can actually grab a robot like this and make it do something cool. Why don't you explain how you program, Mechanoid? I come installed with a technology called Learned Intelligent Motion, or LIM for short. It's simple to program me. Now. So now I'm gonna try and actually program Mechanoid for you live right now. It's learned intelligent motion. It's a simple push button way to create animations using this robot. It's great to be a gadget standing here at Last Gadget Standing. Step two, press green button to play back recording. So he actually gives me the instructions on how to create animations with him. So, learn intelligent motion. Now, how are you able to do learn intelligent motion, Mechanoid? Well, these are my servos. They work as both motors and sensors. And this is my core microcontroller. It's called the Mechabrain. It can record and play back animations process voice recognition, and communicate with smart devices through Bluetooth. So communicating with smart devices through Bluetooth. So what I'm gonna show you right now is actually, we have another way to create animations, very simple to use with Mechanoid. This is actually the rag doll. So all I have to do is grab his arms and move them around, and Mechanoid will actually follow what I'm doing. So another very simple, very intuitive way to create animations using this, LIM or the app. Actually, when you create animations, they're going to be stored as little modules in a programming environment we're also creating. It's a drag and drop 
scratch-like programming environment that's very easy for anyone to use. You create your animations, you pull it into a workflow, and then suddenly with sensors and stuff like that, you're gonna be able to create complex, intelligent behaviors with a very simple robot. So he is an interactive robot. You can control him through voice commands. He does all kinds of cool stuff. He does dance moves, he does kung fu moves, he tells bad jokes, he tries to engage in conversation with you. But this is more than just a cool interactive character. This is actually a build system. So we wanted to show you just a couple of the many things that you can build with this system. We built this big animatronic dinosaur here, and we call this little guy Ecobot. He's been driving around picking up plastic bottles, and he puts them in the little receptacle here. But by design, this system was meant to be open source. These parts you see here, we're actually providing the 3D files. So if you have a 3D printer or you have access to a 3D printer, you can actually expand upon your own set. And within this brain here, we're actually providing the communications protocol. So if you're a hacker, you're a programmer, you're a coder, this is the perfect platform for you. You can do all kinds of really amazing things with this. So as Andreas said, he's not just your interactive best friend, he's also going to be an educational platform. We envision Mechanoid being the must-have educational platform for teaching kids about social robotics. Not just functional robotics, but social interactive robotics. So he's going to be in every home, in classrooms, in robotics competitions. So good job, Mechanoid. Nice job, Mechanoid. High five. Up high. Most excellent. Thank you. Thank you. Mechanoid. Well done. Future Golden Globe winners right there. Fantastic. Well done. Big round of applause for Mechanoid. Really incredible stuff.